Hi. <clears throat> Hi, it's Alexandria back with you. Don't need that. Um, I found a beautiful spot I just wanted to share with you. So I'm here in Lemoyne and it is absolutely beautiful. And if you look this way, you will see the Swan family. It's all very peaceful, lovely. There's some people fishing in the background, and then there's me, and here I am, actually literally in the water here. <laughs> I'm thinking about a swim, even though I didn't wear my suit, but oh well. I just wanted to do another live just to share this beautiful, beautiful spot. And also, I have come up with a challenge, and I invite you to join me with doing this. So my challenge is to find something that makes you feel free, today and every day this month. And the reason I'm doing that is this month, July, marks, uh, was the end of the month, but uh, two years ago, July, I liberated myself from a very toxic, very long, toxic marriage. And I just want to celebrate that. So I decided to create a challenge where every day you do something that makes you feel free. So for me, that might be just even just going for a swim right here, right now, even though I've got shorts and t-shirt on, if that makes me feel free because I found such a private spot, then I'm going to do it. It might be going commando. It might be going for pee in the woods. <laughs> hey, the bears do it. You know, whatever makes you feel free. So really going for that feeling. Maybe it's just like jumping on a skateboard, you know, and riding it downhill or something. I don't know, whatever your idea of free is, I invite you to post below what makes you feel free and do that. Like maybe it's taking a pajama day, staying inside even if it's sunny out, who knows? But whatever your idea is, I would just invite you to, to share and to join and maybe we can all, you know, join in each other's freedom things. So that would be fun. So just here again, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful scenery. There's those, I don't know if you can see those swans out there. So once again, it's still Canada Day. So happy, happy Canada Day. And I'm just so thrilled to be able to come out and speaking of freedom, this park is free. I just so love that, that I can just go for a short drive and be immersed in all the beauty of nature and it doesn't cost me a dime. And you know, I'm really enjoying that. It's so beautiful here. Hi, Chris. Thanks for watching. Yeah, it's just really, really phenomenal here. And I just love having it all to myself. And, you know, just knowing all my family as well and also enjoying Canada Day. It's just really nice. And oh, there's those swans. See the mama and the daddy and the two little ones? I hope you can see it. <laughs> so anyway, have a wonderful day wherever you're at. And take me up on that challenge. Please comment down below so I know that I'm not doing this, this challenge by myself. I'm going to share it to some other groups I'm in. And yeah, let's make it happen. Let's feel free. I know a lot of people maybe are not because, you know, with all the things we're being asked to do to help each other through this difficult time period, but some people are not feeling free with that. So let's just regenerate that because remember, we attract what we are, not what we want, what we are. So if we are being the essence of freedom and joy, that's what we're going to reap. And so I, I hope that you've enjoyed this short little video. If this resonates and you want more time with me, you want some one-on-one -on -one time, PM me below. This is what I do. You know, life, life coach for many years. So I'm happy to pass on what I've come to know to be true. Mm, big love. Bye for now. Happy Canada Day. Best country ever.